I'm going to show you how to make a turkey out of your hand in six easy steps. So the materials that you're going to need to do this is some construction paper. You're going to need brown, red, yellow, and orange. You'll need a pencil and a marker, and you will need some, you'll need some glue. So what you're going to do first is trace your hand on the brown piece of construction paper. So we're going to trace our hand. And this is step one. Step one is tracing your hand. So there is step one. I traced my hand on the brown piece of paper. And then step two, you are going to draw some feathers on the other three colors. And they can be big or small. Doesn't matter, I did different sizes so that they would look better when I layered them on my turkey. And you can do um, nine of those. You can make them big, tall, small, however you want them. And this is how you draw your feathers. And you just draw them all over the paper so that way you get more. And I did that on all three pieces of paper. And then step, and that's step two, is drawing your feathers. And step three, you're going to cut out your hand and feathers. So step three, we're going to cut out our hand and feathers. And once you've cut it out, this is what it should look like. So this is your turkey, which is your hand, and then your different colored feathers. Red, your, red orange, and yellow. And step four, I mean step three, is cutting. So then... Step four will be gluing our feathers and turkey together. So, I like for my turkey to, um, I like for the thumb to be to my right. So, like, if it's facing me, this is going to be the back and this is the front. So, I want the eye and the mouth of the turkey to go to the right of me. So, we're going to go ahead and draw our eyeball on. So if your hand is laying flat, your thumb should be to the left on the table, and you're going to put the eyeball on the thumb. So it should be right over there. So step four is doing the gluing, and you can put them in whatever order you want. Um, so after you have the eyeball, you're going to flip it over, and you're going to glue the feather at the bottom, and you're going to stick it onto your turkey. Like that. And you can glue them in whatever order you want. I have red, yellow, and orange. And you just glue them all over your turkey, the back of your turkey. And you can layer them or however you want to. I did 11 on mine. I did two, I did a bottom and a top row so that it looked better. So we're gluing. You find an orange one. There is the orange. Alright. So you glue your feathers on just like this for step four. Step four is gluing. And then once you have your feathers on, you need to draw a beak and a snood, which is the orange thing and the red thing. And you can take your scrap paper from your um from your feathers and draw it on there. So you're going to draw a triangle for the beak. Right up there in the corner. And then you're going to draw this weird shape for the snood on the red scrap paper, which is right there. And then you're going to glue that on. Let's see. You're going to cut it out and glue it on. It. Okay. And the snood kind of reminds me of a hot dog. The shape that it's in. Except it's bent. Oh. Okay, got our snood. And now our beak.
cutting out a triangle for the beak. Okay. And you're going to glue those onto your turkey. And you're also going to glue those onto the back as well. And you're going to glue them onto the back of the thumb. Let's see. My beak is a little small. Oh, can't pick it up. Okay. Let's see here. And you're going to put it near the eyeball. So there's the beak. And then the snood, which is the red thing. Okay. Well, mine's stuck to the paper. There we go. Alright. And then you have the beak and the snood. And that is step five. And once you've completed step five, you can write on your, um, you can write on your turkey, and it's going to say, I am thankful for dot, dot, dot. So you're going to write, I am thankful for. And then you have four fingers to write, four things that you're thankful for. So you could write your family, your friends, life, food. Whatever you're thankful for, you just fill them in on the four fingers. And this is the finished product. This was my pre-made turkey that I already had done. And I did double the feathers on the back in a little color code. So I did like red, yellow, orange, and I repeated that pattern. And this is how you make a turkey out of your hen. I thought it would be a cute little craft for um, elementary teachers to do in an elementary school for the month of November or the first or the week of Thanksgiving going into it and students are able to write what they're thankful for and understand the meaning of Thanksgiving and how we celebrate for being thankful. So this is just a cute little craft you can do. Thanks for watching.